Yum yum! Hello, Lukas Pazera here. In this tutorial, we are going to create a custom ACS rig preset that will be an extension of the default one. We are going to extend the rig with an extra control that could be used to attach accessories such as the weapons. We start by dropping the ACS byte rig into the scene. The ACS rig is built from assemblies, so if you go to schematic view and click the assemblies overview, you will see one main assembly that contains all the other assemblies that build the character. So it's much like a modular build uh, where each section of the rig, such as the arms, legs, or fingers are separate assemblies. So it's pretty natural that if you want to extend the rig with something new, we will also add it as a separate module contained within an assembly. Let's zoom in a little bit to see the naming convention for ACS assemblies. And let's add the sub assembly now that will contain our accessory rig and I'll call it character one double underscore accessory awesome. So it's very important to follow ACS naming convention when naming um, any new items that you add to the rig. So that gets gets us a new assembly here. I'll change its color to cyan just so it's a bit easier to see and just place it somewhere. I actually see that I changed the color of the main assembly by accident. I don't want to do that, so let's set it to white. And let's find the the assembly. And um, to complete the setup, we need to set some tags for this assembly. So let's go to properties, tags, and let's take a look at any other assembly to see what we need to set. So the first thing we need to set is the RGGP uh, tag, which means regroup, and it just tells ACS what kind of group it is inside the ACS rig and it says it has the value group awesome which means that it's an assembly so let's copy this value and create another uh, the same tag on our new assembly item now the other one we need to do is the rig ident which is the unique identifier for the entire rig so we have to copy that one as well so that's rgid and the third one, RG, uh, SG, is the rig segment, which is uh, basically the name of the module of this or the segment that we are uh, implementing. So RG, SG, and I will call it accessory. Now we need to define how the new module is going to fit within the hierarchy of the other modules that build uh, the ACS rig. And to do that, we're going to go to item list, find the character rig folder, unfold it, and there is the segment map folder under which there's a series of group locators arranged in the hierarchy that reflects how the dependencies between the modules. As you can see, a finger um, modules are children of the of the arm, and then the, this one is children of the torso. So this way, when you delete the torso, for example, ACS knows that it needs to delete all the other depending modules depending on it uh, as well. So to integrate our accessory module, we will add the um, group locator item. So under locators, group locator, and we will call it character one accessory space and open parenthesis segment so again following naming convention is pretty important now uh, we obviously do not want this to be part uh, a child of the left arm actually because we want to be able to parent the control to different parts of the rig uh, as needed we're just going to make it a child of the topmost base segment and let's also lock the item and let's see what kind of tags we need to set. So I'm just going to ch choose the torso and see. So we really need the rig ident and uh, rig segment tag to just tell this is really an item representative of the accessory segment. So I'm going to do RGSG and do accessory. So it has to be the same value for all the um, items uh, across the same uh, module. We could add the rig ident as well, but there's a way to add it in one go for all the new items that you add to the rig hierarchy. So we do this later in one go and won't be doing this one by one. It's crucial that any new items or modifiers that you add to the rig are added to the module assembly as well. Otherwise, when we save the entire rig as a new preset at the end, it will not be complete.
Yum, yum!